and we welcome you to a lively Monday. Over to you. Are we live? We're live. Well, you didn't say we're live. You you hinted that we might be live. Well, I think definitely. Okay. We are definitively live. Okay, well, I am Vigora. We're back with another episode of Drinks with Tickets. And this week, in honor of St. Patrick's Day, our theme is the drinking oh the green. Get it? Okay. We are just so witty around here. I know. Uh, too bad nobody appreciates it. So, every drink this week will be green. And we're going to start off the week right with a St. Patrick's Martini. Now, a lot of these drinks are just regular cocktails with something green added. So, we're going to start as with any good cocktail. We're going to make it in a shaker, and we're going to start with some gin. Always gonna, a good choice. Oh, it's a fine choice. Fine choice. And we're going to add three ounces of gin. This is a very simple cocktail. Three ounces of gin is a great way to start a week. That's right. Monday, Monday. Monday. And then we're going to add an ounce of melon liqueur that I didn't open ahead of time. Yes. Excuse me. Oh, the production staff has failed again. Once again. But see, there we go. Not a problem. An ounce. That's it. Three ounces of gin. An ounce of melon liqueur. And, and then I need to shake it. We have to come in for the timing. Tell me when to start. Go for it. Ah, right. so you're going to shake it good. So if you don't shake it well, there'll be cheers at bedtime. Ina Garten will be beating on our That's door. That's right. I would love it if Ina Garten came <laughs> and knocked on our door. That would be fantastic. I would say Barefoot Contessa, come right on Five, in. Five, four, three, Two, one, done. All right. Nothing like a simple cocktail. <coughs> Chilled cocktail glass. Come in for the pour, Larry. Oh, that's a lovely green. Yeah, it's green, all right. That's kind of ridiculous. <laughs> that's gorgeous, actually. I'm sure it looks great on camera. All right, here we go with the taste. A melon teeny. You know, here's the thing. Can any cocktail really be bad if there's gin in it? It's very unusual, and I'm gonna admit, this is not for everyone. The melon liqueur with the gin is a very unique taste, but I think it's delicious. So, happy St. Patrick's Day week. Go make a green drink. We'll have more. See you later. Tune in tomorrow for more green craziness.